Combustion can happen in one of two ways, as a subsonic deflagration or as a supersonic detonation. Modern internal combustion engines function using deflagrations, however, detonations are a more efficient form of combustion so in theory, detonation engines could outperform traditional ones. Previous GDPs at Southampton have attempted to produce a rotating detonation engine, in which a detonation wave continuously travels around a ring-shaped chamber. The RDE proved successful, but highlighted a need to better understand wave propagation. Therefore, the aim of our project was to produce a rig for detonation research. These rigs are known as detonation tubes. The concept is simple. It consists of a sealed tube filled with a combustible mixture, with some way of igniting the combustion at one end. Upon ignition, the gases begin to burn, initially as a deflagration. If the conditions are right, the combustion wave undergoes deflagration to detonation transition and eventually stabilises into a steady detonation. Our tube was designed with modularity in mind, and as such, the different sections are fully reconfigurable, making it possible to focus the experiments on different phases of the detonation. This also makes it easy to upgrade the tube by adding specialised sections, such as our custom test section, which includes windows, allowing future projects to image detonations with techniques like Schlieren photography. Flow imaging may also be achieved through the use of soot or smoked foils, which show the detonation cell pattern left behind as the wave passes over them. Soot foils are mounted to a modular carriage, which also allows for the study of obstacle detonation interactions anywhere in the tube. Simulations can be used to predict these interactions, which may then be compared with primary data and literature. Our final design was successful in qualification and detonation tests, meeting our original project aims. So the objective here is to study detonation cells and record them by using soot foils in a tube that is completely modular. You could say that we are investigating the Three, two, one. <gasps> oh my Whoa. god!